The Google app is at the heart of all Android phones. Most people don't have any problems with it, but some may. In this video, we'll show you how to fix the annoying Google app crashing error that seems to happen every time you use your Android. By the way, please like and share our videos to help those who might have the same issues so that we can help them too. Once you're done, then let's begin. First, for stop Google app. One simple way to fix a Google app that keeps crashing is to make sure you use the For Stop button on the app's info page. Here's what you need to do. Go to your app menu. Tap and hold Google app. Tap more info icon. Tap For Stop. Next, check for updates. If you haven't updated the Google app in a long time, you might also have this problem. You're lucky that it's easy to find out if your Google apps have the latest updates. What you need to do, open the Google Play Store app. In the search box above, search for Google app. From the search results, find and tap Google. Tap update button. If there's no update button, this means that the Google app is already updated. Next, delete Google app updates. Uninstalling updates for the Google app is another way to fix the problem. This update method is the exact opposite of the last one. Here's how. Open the Google Play Store app. In the search box above, search for Google app. From the search results, find and tap Google. Select the uninstall button. Try doing whatever you were doing previously to see if the Google app has stopped crashing. Next, reboot your phone. If your Android device has been running for a long time, Google Apps might not work right. You should restart your phone at least once every few days to give it a fresh start and maybe fix some small bugs. As a general rule, you push and hold the power button for a few seconds to restart an Android. Then, go to the power menu and choose restart to restart your Android phone. Next, clear the Google app cache and data. Each app on your Android phone keeps temporary files and data in a folder called cache. This cache or data can sometimes get messed up and cause problems. Here's how. Go to app menu. Tap and hold Google app. Tap more info. Tap storage. Tap clear cache. If the problem still occurs, then try to clear its data. Next, reinstall Android System WebView. For some people, the Android System WebView is the main reason why their Google app keeps crashing. The Android System WebView, like the Google app, is a core app in Android OS. If it's having trouble, it could affect other system apps. Here's how. Open the Google Play Store app. In the search box above, search for Android System WebView. From the search results, find and tap Android System WebView. Select the Uninstall button. Next, use Google Go app. The Google Go app is a simpler version of the regular Google app that is made for Android devices with less power and slower networks. To use this alternative app, just open the Google Play Store and download Google Go. Once you've installed Google Go, restart your Android device to see if that fixed the app crashing on Android. Next, reset app preferences. Some apps can use default system apps and services. Apps that depend on these core apps and services might not work right if their settings are wrong or if they are not available. Here's how. Open Settings app. Tap Apps. Tap on more settings at the upper right three dot icon. Select Reset App Preferences. Restart your Android phone and check it help to fix Google app crashing issue. Next, check for updates. Google sometimes makes changes to the Android versions. Make sure to install any version of the Android OS that you haven't already put on your device. Just go to Settings. Then, Software Update to find out. Lastly, perform a factory reset. If nothing has worked so far, you'll have to do something drastic like wipe the device and reset its software to factory settings. Create a backup of your personal data, 
and remove your Google account. Open Settings app. Scroll to and tap General Management. Tap Reset. Select Factory Data Reset from the given options. Read the information then tap Reset to continue. Tap Delete All to confirm action. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it. If you can leave a like or comment, subscribe to our channel or share this video to your friends. This can greatly help in making Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.